May I call this uh, meeting to order? Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance and the invocation that follows. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Dear God, please bless our elected officials. Grant them the wisdom to know and the courage to do what is right for all citizens. Amen. 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 Roll call, please. Allen? Here. Green? Here. LaFour? Here. Ms. Stravich? Here. Rindell? Here. Ricks? Here. Warren? Here. Let's see, everybody's here. My approval of minutes for the budget workshop of May 20th would be in order. I'll make the motion. Support. What's been made and supported. Is there any discussion? Do you not? All in favor of the motion, signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We also have the minutes from the regular meeting of the same evening on May 20, 2019. Is there a motion for those minutes? I'll make that motion. Support. Motion has been made and supported. Any discussion on those minutes? Do you not? All in favor say aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We have audience comments on the non-agenda items. There is no one in the audience this evening, so I will go directly uh, to adoption of the agenda. Mr. City Manager, any changes? No changes. City Council, any changes? No. Nope. Motion to accept the agenda as presented would be in order. I'll make the motion. Support. Motion been made and supported. Any discussion? Being not, all in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. Is there a motion for the consent agenda? I'll make a motion to approve the consent agenda as presented. Support. Motion has been made and supported. There's no discussion on the motion. All in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We move on to items for consideration, which we have six this evening. The first one being consideration of special event requests from St. Augustine Parish. Mr. City Manager. Council is scheduled to consider a request the city received from St. Augustine Church to conduct the Walk with Jesus event. Uh, the event is scheduled for Sunday, June 23rd, and, and is in conjunction with the Holy Family Parish in Memphis. We've, our police department has helped escort them uh, north to the city limits uh, for the past several years. Thank you. Is there a motion? I make the motion to approve the request received from St. Augustine Church conduct their Corpus Christi Walk with Jesus event down Main Street beginning at approximately 7.30 a.m. on Sunday, June 23rd, 2019 at St. Augustine Church and traveling north along Main Street to Holy Parish Church in Memphis. Support. Motion has been made and supported. Is there any discussion? Chief, uh, no indication of any issues? No. Okay. Early in the morning. Early? Yeah. All in favor of the motion, signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We hope for good weather for them. Item number two is consideration of special event request across the road banner, uh, Richmond Area um, <laughs> Historical and Genealogical Society request uh, for their Heritage Festival. Mr. City Manager. Council is scheduled to consider a request for an across the road banner from RAGS for the uh, banner associated with the Heritage Festival on June 29th and 30th. RAGS would like the banner up Friday, June 15th through Sunday, June 30th. Thank you. Is there a motion? I make a motion to approve the request from the Richmond Area Historical and Genealogical Society to have an across the road banner in conjunction with their Heritage Festival to be displayed Friday, June 15th through Sunday, June 30th, 2019. Support. What's been made and supported. Any discussion? Seeing none, all in favor of the motion, signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We wish them good luck on their festival. Item number three is consideration of memorial bench from Georgia Statura. Mr. City Manager. Council is scheduled to give consideration accepting a memorial bench request submitted by Georgia Statura in honor of her father, George F. Captain. Uh, both Georgia and her father have attended our meal program uh, for several years in the community center and uh, with uh, him passing away and, and the fact that he was a veteran uh, US, from the U.S. Army, 
uh, he, she would like a memorial bench placed uh, in the BB Park with uh, a plaque rep, uh, recognizing himself and all those that served. Okay, is there a motion before discussion? I make a motion to approve the purchase of a memorial bench purchased from Perennial Park Products in the amount of $436 to recognize George F. Captain. Support. Most been made and supported. Discussion. I'm trying to figure out the picture that's presented there. Mm -hmm. That is going to be where, that's a sandbox where the water is? Yes. Okay. Yeah, it was taken earlier this spring, so it's yeah. the sandbox. There used to be kind of the diggers that were yes. in there, but over the years we had to take those out. So you're kind of at the pools in the background. Okay, and that's the existing bench, I take it. That's the existing bench. Looks like a wooden yes. bench. Ooh, yes, correct. Okay, it's not yeah. a memorial no. bench? Okay. No. Okay. It's apart. Any other discussion or questions? All in favor of the motion, signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. We thank uh, Mrs. Statura for that donation to the park. <clears throat> Item number four is consideration of fire contracts. Mr. City Manager. Council is scheduled to consider approving the City of Richmond's fire contracts with the three surrounding townships, Casco, Columbus, and Richmond. Chief Spens and former Chief Garrett have been meeting with myself and the three township supervisors uh, negotiating these contracts since uh, this past March. Uh, the contracts are very similar in nature to uh, the contracts that we've had for a long time with our three surrounding townships uh, with kind of three exceptions uh, this year. Uh, the first being that instead of a three-year contract, we would go to a five-year contract. Uh, the second is that as we've been trying to do the last contract is to increase the amount that each municipality contributes to the equipment fund. So uh, this year's contract over the five years uh, will take that amount from 12500 up to 15000 the final year of the contract. And then on the third item, uh, Supervisor Bill uh, Rubinaff from Casco Township had asked for uh, it to put, be put in the contract that we would provide them copies of their monthly run reports uh, or run reports on a monthly basis. Uh, we're already doing that, and so he just wants it in the contract to make sure that we continue. Mm -hmm. Very uh, good. With that, uh, all townships are in agreement with this, I believe. It's in front of all three township boards next week. Very good. Okay. Is there a motion? I'll make a motion to approve the 2019 to 2024 fire contracts with Casco, Columbus, and Richmond townships and authorize the mayor to sign. Support. It's been made and seconded. <clears throat> Any discussion? Looks good. Much better than, you know, looks like the townships are willing to help out on uh, as expensive as the equipment has become now and, and uh, that we're trying to keep up with uh, the equipment and the reliability of our equipment. Right, and I think with recent years having to purchase a couple new uh, vehicles and, and then we've been kind of keeping track of the equipment fund with the memo so that they can kind of see uh, both ourselves and, and the department and the townships can see where we're at with that fund. They realize it's just not keeping up. Certainly these changes aren't going to overnight <laughs> make that happen, uh, but with townships you uh, uh, need to work with them and allow them to budget too so uh, we're heading in the right direction but very good very good any other comments or questions okay well we'd like to thank our new chief and I understand our old chief was also in on the deliberations with the townships I'd like to thank you John uh, the three of you guys for getting this done and in a timely basis besides that and thank the townships for uh, you know, joining hands with us and trying to beef up that fund to replace our equipment over the long term. So, appreciate it. Uh, it's nice to hear that they uh, sound like you guys all worked very well together. Yes. That's yes. good to hear that we can work with our neighbors like and, that. And, and I can say from all three township supervisors, uh, they are very happy with the service they get from Richmond and, and uh, are very pleased with what, what Richmond provides in the RVFD. Very good. Very good. Okay. All in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion passes. You guys want an opportunity to get the new chief on the uh, TV again. <laughs> <coughs> Getting lucky here, chief. 
I like them. <laughs> nice and quick. Item number five, consideration of establishing a quarterly roundtable meeting date. Mr. City Manager. Council schedule it to uh, set its next quarterly roundtable meeting date. Uh, normally, uh, we try to have that in July. I think last year we had to bump back to August. Um, in the past several years, uh, we've been trying to place them on the same nights that we have a council meeting. Um, I did place the uh, calendar pages in your uh, packet uh, in July. The two meeting dates would be the 1st and the 15th would be our regular meetings, and August would be the 5th and the 19th. Okay, thank you. Uh, Council, if we could, uh, as we have in the past, suspend the rules for a minute and come up with a date and a time before there's a motion. Is that okay with the Council? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh, Jamie, uh, you're going to be out of town on the 1st? So I changed my plane ticket, so I will make the first meeting now. Oh, okay. But I will not be here for the 15th. Okay. So is the uh, July 1st going to work for the administration? I'm just trying to remember what we have from like the budget workshops to yeah. play. Certainly for like the review of the goals and objectives and, and those items, yes, yeah. we'll, we'll be fine for them. Yep. Okay. Well, maybe we're pushing it a little hard then. But I'm just trying to off the top of my head remember sometimes we kick stuff from the budget workshop discussions to that round table, that first one. Um, we, we do, do have, have a, a fifth, fifth Monday, Monday in July, the 29th. Mm. How's that look for everybody? Hold that would give uh, time for anybody to... Right, because I'm not going to be here the August... Uh, fifth. The week of that night. No, I'll be, well, never mind. So would the fifth Monday of the month work? Whatever works for you. Yep. Works for me, right? For me. Fourth or fifth, it doesn't matter. Or the fifth. The fifth, but the fifth two works. August the fifth. fifth. The fifth is what I'm talking about right August now. August fifth. Oh, you got a fifth Monday. No, he's no. saying August 5th. August 5th. August 5th. Oh, August that 5th. That next council meeting, the first one in August. But John's going to be gone. No, oh. I'll be here. No, I will oh, be here. Oh, you are here? Yes. Gone, no. He's going to well, be gone. gone. Okay. It's a civic holiday in Canada, so Dennis is going to be gone. <laughs> 29th. <laughs> Customers up there. I, I can't birthday. do the 29th. Okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, Jamie just said. Well, how's the 29th looking? I can't she do the 29th. You're not going to be able to do it. <laughs> go back then. How about the 22nd? Yes. No. Yeah. You can do the 22nd. Yep. I can do the 22nd. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Well, then, is that good for, with the administration? Mm -hmm. 22nd. Right now. Mm -hmm. July 22nd. Okay, at 6. Is that going to work? Yep. Okay. Back. Uh, is there a motion? I'll Any make the motion to schedule the special quarterly roundtable meeting city council on July 22nd, starting at 6 p.m. Support. Motion been made and support. Any discussion on that? Being none, all in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. 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 Against? Motion does pass. And we have item number six, consideration of establishing a joint meeting with the Recreation Board. Mr. City Manager. Council is scheduled to consider establishing a special joint meeting with the Recreation Board to review uh, sections six through eight of the Recreation Master Plan. Uh, the Recreation Board at their meeting had discussed even uh, coming to a City Council meeting and having the special meeting start immediately following one of your regular meetings, either in July or August. Uh, all of the background work is done for these. It's already been presented to the rec board, so uh, we would be ready for any of the meetings. Okay, that's why I was kind of pushing that first meeting just we just did, because I'd like to see this early on, because I know everything was presented yep. at the meeting, yep. the rec meeting. So uh, go back. Is the first good for everybody? July 1st. The first. Yeah. first. The first? July 1st. Mm -hmm. the July yes. 1st. Yes. Oh, yeah. That's a council meeting. Yep. yep. Do it right work. after. Right so after. do it right after? Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Absolutely. Okay. So July 1st now? For the rack no, no, meeting. This, this is no, item no, number yep. six. No, that's what, uh, yeah, that's what I got. I'm gonna... Okay. Is there a motion to that effect? I make a motion to establish a joint meeting of the City Council and Recreation Board immediately following the regular, regularly scheduled council meeting on July 1st, 2019 to review sections 
oh boy, <laughs> six, seven, and eight of the recreation master plan. Support what's been made and support any discussion. Uh, yes, Mr. Mayor, yep. this is a reminder that we go to the summer <laughs> schedule that meeting. So yeah. the city council meeting will be at six. Yeah. It'll be earlier than normal for meeting with the library board. Yeah. Yep. Okay. That's it for our items for consideration. Uh, miscellaneous matters from the city manager, sir. Uh, the library director and myself are meeting uh, with the kind of consult library consultants that have done space needs studies for other libraries. Uh, so we're uh, meeting with them to see if they can prepare a proposal for our consideration. And we're doing that tomorrow. Uh, this bid package for the streetscape signs is out to the plan rooms. Uh, due later this month with uh, TIFA awarding it at their meeting this month. The uh, speak at the Lions Club meeting tomorrow night. Uh, today, uh, Chief Teske and myself uh, gave tours of City Hall and the Police Department to about 100 third graders, so uh, everything went well, and I think they uh, did a nice job kind of uh, taking a look and talking about the city. So it's always interesting to see from a third grader's perspective what the city does, and, <laughs> and uh, but uh, some good comments and good participation with the kids. Uh, DTE, they did have their subcontractor in uh, today starting to do some work on the uh, light poles, uh, particularly up in the north end. And that's all I have. Very good. Okay. Council comments. Rob? Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Emily? Nothing tonight, thank Maybe. you. Nothing. Good. Also good. No, thank you. Thank you. Well, very good. I'd like to um, thank the VFW uh, and Mother Nature for beautiful weather on Memorial Day. Uh, everybody that participated in the parade and those of us that could make it that day. Um, and again, thank you to our VFW for putting together the color guard and marching all the way down there and um, helping out and along with uh, John and, and John Einan, uh, who had to be away this year. Um, we had a great crowd. I think it had a lot to do with the great weather. And um, it was very nice to see people that were out and showing their respects to those that uh, sacrificed their lives uh, for us. So we move on. Uh, we do have a closed session this evening. Is there a motion to go into closed session? I'll make a motion to go into closed session in accordance with Section 8C of the Michigan Open Meetings Act, Public Act. 267 of 1976 as amended for strategy and negotiation sessions uh, connected with the negotiation of a collective bargaining agreement as requested by administration. Support. What's been made and supported? Is there any discussion? Being not, roll call vote, please. Green? Yes. LaFour? Yes. Ms. Stravich? Yes. Rindell? Yep. Ricks? Yes. Warren? Yes. Allen? Yes. Motion does pass. We will convene into closed session.